everybody in YouTube land. We're out here at VHP working on this 69 Firebird right here. We're doing an LS swap. We're just about to finish with it. Uh, I got quite a few people asking me about the hose clamps that we're using. So we're using this style hose clamp here. What happens is it's basically like a heat shrink for the hose clamp. So take these little hose clamps, squeeze the Squeeze it a couple times, get the cardboard that's inside that's holding it, kind of break loose. Take a pin nose pliers, just kind of shove it in here without getting the rubber piece. Just kind of grab that, do a little twisting. Of course, yesterday I did it perfectly and never had problems, but today, there we go. So a little gap right there, stick this in there. Twist, makes the cardboard smaller, and it just slides right out. So this is, feels like a hard plastic, but it's a shrink wrap. And so what we're gonna do, we're gonna get two of these and put it on the upper radiator hose so you guys can see that. And then we're gonna, it has numbers on it for part number and where the manufacturer is. So what we're gonna do is we're gonna hide that so we have the blacks facing straight up so you don't see those numbers so it looks more clean. So what we're gonna do is take this hose, pull this off, slide that on, and then just slide it over. Just like that. So we'll position it so we make sure it's clamped over the end of the hose. The nipple part of the fitting is right about here. So we'll put it on like so. And then angle it so when you're looking straight down on it or so much to the sides, you can see that that is covered so you only see the black. Let's take this one off here, do the same thing. These are basically double the size of regular hose clamps. They cost about around six bucks each, five to six dollars, depending on where you get them from. But as you can see, like that. Nipple is right there. So we want it just past that nipple, just a hair. So we make sure we have good clamp. Just like a regular hose clamp, you just want to get just a hair past the hose. The nip. So, that's about where we want it. Now we got a heat gun. Take your little heat gun and all you do is just apply a little bit of heat and it'll start shrinking a little bit and then just evenly go around the fitting to heat the, the heat shrink and you're good to go. So it's hot pretty fast. Don't stay in one spot too long. If you do, you'll start to melt parts. But as you can see, it's already shrunk down onto the hose quite a bit. We just verify and make sure that we have it all the way around nice and even. And you can see how it's shrunken up onto the hose itself. And that should be it. So you can see the difference between this hose and this hose. You can see how it's shrunken up on it. And it's got a nice grip on that. So she's nice and tight, just like a hose clamp would be. So that was just a quick little video of what, how to do how to do these little shrink wraps onto the hose clamp. So uh, if you guys have any questions or if you want something done for your vehicle, hit us up.
Tell me pretty lies, look me 